This tutorial shows you how to install OpenFire. OpenFire is needed for the chat function in the VS Portal to work. This is best shown by logging into the VS Portal. Open the web browser and go to the VS Portal client login. Enter the client login and password and login. At the top right of the screen there are four buttons Call, SMS, Connect to and Chat. Chat will not work unless OpenFire is installed. Before you install OpenFire, first you have to create the OpenFire database in the MySQL command line client. Go to the Start button and run MySQL command line client. Enter the password. At the MySQL prompt, input the following command and hit Return. To show that the database has been created, type the following and hit return. OpenFire should appear in the list of databases. Close the window. Now that the database has been created, we can install OpenFire software. Go to the install directory. And third party folder. And the OpenFire folder. Double click on the OpenFire installer file. The install wizard should open. Select the language as English and click OK. Then click Next. Accept the agreement and click Next. And click Next again. Tick the Don't create a start menu folder and click Next. When the setup is complete, click Finish to run OpenFire. Wait until the Launch Admin button has become active. Then click Launch Admin. This will take you to the OpenFire setup in your browser. Choose the language as English and click Continue. Change the domain to the IP address of your server and click Continue. Choose Standard Database Connection and click Continue. From the drop-down menu, select MySQL for the database settings. In the Database URL field, change Hostname to Localhost and change the database name to OpenFire. Enter the username as root and the password. Then click Continue. Select the default for the profile settings and click Continue. Next you will be prompted to create an administrator account. You will create an admin account in VS Database instead, so skip this step. The setup is now complete. Before we can log in to the admin console, we need to create an admin account. Minimize your browser and the open firebox and go to the start button and run the MySQL command line. Enter your password and input the following. Log in to the VSM and go to the Retail Clients menu item. Go to the General tab to the Login and Password fields and create a new login and password. Uncheck the Active box and go to the Funds and Tariff tab. Select a currency and a tariff. Then click the Add New icon to the right. The login admin and the password will be used to log in to the OpenFire admin console. The login must be set as admin. Go to the OpenFire admin console and click login to the admin console. Input the password we have just created and click login. Next you need to configure the server settings. Go to the Server Settings tab and go to the Server to Server menu item. Set the Service Enable tab to Disabled and click Save Settings. Then go to the Registration and Login menu item and disable the following settings. Inbound Account Registration, Change Password and Anonymous Login. Then Save Settings. You can then log out of the admin console. 
Next, go to the Windows command line and execute the following command. And close the window. OpenFire is now installed and configured for your server. To verify the OpenFire installation, open the VS Portal in your browser. Click on the Chat button and you will see that the user is available and the chat function is ready to work. Thank you.